Hey you guys, App Goddess here, and I want to share an app with you that I absolutely love. It crashes every once in a while, but it does not diminish my love for it. It's called My Shows. And if you're like me, you need this app. And by like me, I mean if you're somebody who watches like five or six shows at a time, if you're watching stuff online, if you're watching stuff on DVD, if you're watching stuff on regular television, you need this app. What it does is it allows you to keep track of the last episode you watched of a particular show. And it's just a lot of fun. So these are my current shows. Uh, Justify, which is over. The last episode was Bulletville. Drop Dead Diva, which I caught on Hulu. And the last episode was Grayson's Anatomy. Um, the last episode of The City I watched was I Lost Myself in Us. Now, this I need to update. Now, you do have to update it, so that's one thing. But True Blood is on season three, episode three. Is not the last episode I watched. The last episode I watched of True Blood was season three, episode four, which was called Nine Crimes. So I've updated that. And now that's represented. Now, the last episode of Mad Men, of course, was Shut the Door and Have a Seat. That was the season finale of season three. So then when season four starts, I will update that. Now, the way you add shows is you browse the shows. Now, you can search. You can just type it in or you can scroll. And they have everything in here. I mean, they have tons of stuff. They update all the time and update might show up as I'm scrolling through this because usually when you open it, if they have updated or you switch to here from the My Shows section, it'll say, oh, we've got some new shows. Do you want to add them? So let's look for something to add that I need to look at. Ah, I'm thinking of Burn Notice, which I'm pretty sure is on here. And another thing is if you're looking at, there's Burn Notice, stuff on Netflix. That's the other thing I wanted to mention. All right, now Burn Notice is on right now. Oops, I pressed the add a show, so we don't want that. We want to set up Burn Notice. Now, Burn Notice is now on season three. Oops, not season four. And I just finished episode four. I probably actually need to... No, sorry. Burn Notice is actually on episode four. Because I remember that episode day. That was from four. All right. So actually I'm on... What? I need to watch one of these again because I fell asleep. So we're going to say my last episode watch was episode three. I need to watch episode four again. So we're just going to make that my last episode watch. And then you have your graphic there. And there's your show. So another thing I would like to add here is Breaking Bad. I did start season three of Breaking Bad, but I have not. I stopped. So. Was it season two? No, I think it was season two. See, this is why I need this app. I can't even remember. This is it. The season two. Mm. No. The last episode I watched was Down. I was watching that on DVD. Now, like I said, if, for instance, you want to update, you do it here. You can email your stuff to you and then sync with uh, Kudit. That's not something I use, so I'm not going to get into that. Because I just basically use it, whoops, for this. Cancel. Sorry. And... That's what I use it for all the time. Now, you can add a show if there is no graphic or it's not in the list, which is actually what I had to do for the city. For a long time, the city was not in here as a graphic, and when it's no graphic, it's just like a little gray square there, and you can't, you know, you can't add your own photograph. You just have to deal with it, and if they notice a lot of people are adding stuff, they usually add a graphic because Drop Dead Diva wasn't in there before, Justify wasn't in there before. A lot of things that they have added were not in there the last couple of times I updated. So they do, um, they do continually update this, and I notice it's not crashing as much as it was before. I love this app because I watch so much stuff at once and it just it just helps it's a great idea it's a lot of fun go check it out if you're like me I think you will really really love it and have a lot of fun with it I really do and I know you're like well I gotta pay for it and it crashes sometimes but it doesn't crash as often and actually 
I think most of the crashing was from the OS 4 update that I was dealing with before and I rectified that and so now it's actually not having that much of a problem. If you start switching around and back and forth and adding things, ooh, like I just did, sometimes it does crash. But I still have to say it's awesome mainly just because of what it does. And I need what it does. And that is keep track of all the shows that I'm watching. And shows I want to watch. So I see a ton of stuff that I could add in here. But I'm not going to because I'm trying to get other stuff done besides watch TV. But this app is just so much fun. So check it out. It's only 99 cents. I think you'll really love it. And if you're like me, like I said, you will get a lot of use out of this app. So thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.